Hello, Paul Hamilton here for iPad Monthly. Um, let me show you what we're actually going to do today. So we're actually using numbers and we're going to make a little simulation of a car park kind of formula. So we've been talking with our kids about digital solutions and what we actually want to do is start prototyping things that are in real life that use computer programs. So for example, if I kind of cut and paste a little car here, you'll see down the bottom that it goes to 16. So we've got a little formula here that works out basically how many spots are left. And we're gonna create that. Kids love doing this, it's a whole lot of fun. So let's have a look at how we actually do it. So we'll jump back into numbers. Uh, we'll create a new spreadsheet. And I am using the latest version of numbers. So if mine looks a little bit different to yours, um, just be aware that that's probably why. So updating numbers would be a good start with that. And what we're gonna do is we're just gonna create um, we're going to actually shade in the cells. So I'm just going to touch and drag the little anchor points there. And I'll just go three by 10 basically. And I'll go up to my paintbrush and I'll put a little kind of uh, fill, just a very light fill so that you can see the cells that we're working with, just a little light blue. And what we're going to do is place um, some cars, some little emojis in those spots um, and then basically create a formula in a cell. So I'm just going to double tap in one of the cells, go down to my emojis and put a little transport vehicle in there. And I might do that with that one as well. Uh, so we'll just go down the bottom here, this time put a little bike in. Uh, they're pretty cute. And down at the bottom cell, we'll just put a type a little bit of text to say, uh, this is going to be the spaces that are left. And in the cell next to it is where we're going to create the little formula. So if you're new to formulas and new to spreadsheets, don't worry too much. It's pretty easy to do. Um, I'm going to double tap. And you can see on the bottom right-hand corner next to cell, there's a little equal sign. So just press the equal sign and then press on the left-hand side the FX. And that's where all the, um, I guess, all the functions are that we can actually create. And the one that we're going to use today is called counter. And all that basically does is it counts... Uh, the um, the things that are in the cells that we actually uh, shaded. So if we actually go up here, haven't done it yet, um, we have to actually kind of dictate and tell the formula that we want to count all of the things that are in the blue squares. So what we're going to do is double tap again and see where it says value. We're going to press on value once and then we're just going to go up, press the first cell and just drag very slowly down the cells that we want to count and it says they're B2 three to d through to D11 and we'll press the equal sign and there it is. Uh, but basically what that's doing at the moment is that's counting how many are there. So if we double tap that cell again and put a little, uh, if I can get it at the front there, try again. Uh, okay. Oh, no, I think I did. So I did counter. Uh, we'll do values again. We'll just go through that process again. Press the first cell, drag down, a little bit slower. Um, gone a little bit fast there, but I'll go up a little bit more, just do a bit by bit. So you can see, uh, go up a little bit more. It's not that cell there, it's those cells, so B2 to D11. And then we just want to touch in before that formula and just put a 30 minus. And what that'll do is it'll say 30 minus um, the counting and all of all the objects. So theoretically, if I press my ticky box there, I've got 28. And if I actually copy one of those little bikes and I put, let's say a car comes along or a bike comes along and gets into this spot, it actually goes down to 27. So just very, very easily, we've created a great little formula that works out the spaces that are left in a car park. Really easy to do. As 